Hi everyone, welcome back to Park and Post. Today we're going to talk about the TSA's list of prohibited items. We'll go through 35 items that are not allowed in carry-on luggage and discuss why they're considered dangerous. As seasoned travelers, we have many years of air travel experience. We are frequent flyers and thoroughly enjoy the convenience of flying. With our insight, we can provide guidance on the rules and regulations of what can and cannot be brought on a plane. I often get asked by our subscribers what they can take through airport security, so we made this video to help you out. Today, like I said before, we will go over 35 items that you absolutely cannot bring in your carry-on suitcase or bag. The Transportation Security Administration TSA, maintains a list of prohibited items that are not allowed to be carried on board an airplane, either in carry-on luggage or checked luggage. Here are 35 items that are on the TSA's list. Number 1. Guns and Firearms It's important to note that firearms are not allowed in carry-on luggage, but they are allowed in checked luggage. This is a lesson I learned the hard way when I accidentally brought my father's antique gun in my carry-on luggage. I was flying to visit my grandparents in the countryside, and I was in a hurry to pack. I didn't think to check my bag thoroughly, and I ended up bringing the gun with me. I only realized my mistake when I was pulled aside by the TSA agents for a random security check. It was a scary experience, and I learned my lesson. Always double-check your luggage and make sure you're not bringing any prohibited items with you on your trip. Guns and firearms are strictly prohibited on all flights, including replica and toy guns. This is to ensure the safety of all passengers and crew members on board, as firearms can pose a significant risk in an enclosed space. The TSA allows firearms to be transported in checked luggage as long as they are unloaded, properly packed, and declared at the airline check-in counter. However, this is subject to specific rules and regulations, and passengers must comply with them to avoid delays or confiscation of their firearms. Number 2. Explosives and Flammable Items Explosives and flammable items are among the most dangerous items that are not allowed on board. This includes fireworks, hand grenades, and other explosive devices, as well as flammable liquids and fuels like gasoline and lighter fluid. These items are not allowed in either carry-on or checked luggage, as they can cause fires or explosions that can endanger the lives of everyone on board. It's important to note that some seemingly harmless items like aerosol cans may also be considered as flammable and therefore not allowed. Number 3. Knives. Knives are a common item that is not allowed on board, including pocket knives and utility knives. The TSA prohibits any knife with a blade longer than 4 inches, including locking and fixed blade knives. However, there are some exceptions to this rule, such as plastic or round-bladed butter knives, which are allowed on board. The reason for this prohibition is that knives can be used as weapons and can pose a threat to the safety of passengers and crew members. Number 4. Box Cutters Box cutters are specifically prohibited by the TSA, as they were used as weapons during the 9-11 terrorist attacks. The TSA's prohibition extends to any cutting or slicing tool with a fixed or retractable blade, including utility knives and razor blades. Although these items may be useful for everyday tasks, they pose a serious risk to air travel and are therefore not allowed on board. If you need to bring these items for work or other purposes, you can pack them in your checked luggage, but they must be securely wrapped and properly labeled. Number 5. Scissors. Scissors with blades longer than 4 inches are not allowed on board, as they can be used as weapons. However, scissors with blades shorter than 4 inches are generally allowed in both carry-on and checked luggage. It's important to note that not all scissors are created equal, and some types of scissors, such as scissors with pointed tips or serrated edges may still be prohibited. Before packing scissors in your carry-on luggage, it's best to check the TSA's guidelines to ensure that they are allowed. Number 6. Tools. Tools are generally not allowed on board, as they can be used as weapons or can cause damage to the aircraft. This includes wrenches, pliers, screwdrivers, and other hand tools. However, there are some exceptions to this rule, such as small tools that are less than 7 inches in length and screwdrivers that are less than 7 inches in length and have a flat head. These small tools may be carried in your carry-on luggage, 
But larger tools must be packed in your checked luggage. It is important to check with the airline to ensure that they are allowed. Number seven, baseball bats and golf clubs. Baseball bats and golf clubs are not allowed in carry-on luggage, but are permitted in checked luggage. However. Passengers must ensure that these items are properly secured and packaged to avoid damage to other luggage or the aircraft. The TSA recommends that passengers check with their airline for any specific rules or restrictions regarding sports equipment, as some airlines may have their own guidelines. Number eight, martial arts weapons. Martial arts weapons, including nunchucks, throwing stars, and kubatons, are not allowed on board. These items are considered dangerous weapons and can cause harm to other passengers and crew members. If you need to travel with these items for training or competition, you should pack them in your checked luggage and declare them at the check-in counter. The TSA recommends that you pack them securely and use a hard-sided container to prevent damage. Number nine, self-defense sprays. Self-defense sprays, such as pepper spray and mace, are not allowed in carry-on luggage, but are allowed in checked luggage. These sprays must have a safety mechanism to prevent accidental discharge and must be packed in a leak-proof container. Passengers should also ensure that the size of the container is within the limits allowed by the airline. Number 10. Flammable liquids and fuels. Flammable liquids and fuels, including gasoline and lighter fluid, are not allowed on board in either carry-on or checked luggage. These items are highly combustible and can cause fires or explosions that can endanger the aircraft and its occupants. Passengers should also be aware that common household items such as bleach and other chemicals may also be considered as flammable and should be packed in accordance with the TSA's guidelines. Number 11, pool cues. Pool cues are allowed in checked luggage but are not allowed in carry-on luggage. Passengers should ensure that the queue is properly packaged to prevent damage to other luggage or the aircraft. Number 12. Crowbars and Hammers Crowbars and hammers are not allowed in carry-on luggage, but are allowed in checked luggage. Passengers should ensure that these items are properly packaged and do not exceed the size and weight restrictions set by the airline. Before we proceed further, I hope these tips help you have a comfortable and stress-free travel experience. If you're new to our channel, please subscribe and click the bell to be notified of our latest travel tips. But let's get back to the topic, the 35 TSA's list of prohibited items. Number 13. Chainsaws. Chainsaws are not allowed in either carry-on or checked luggage. These items are dangerous and can cause serious harm to other passengers and crew members. Number 14. Meat cleavers and other large cutting tools. Meat cleavers and other large cutting tools are not allowed in carry-on luggage, but are allowed in checked luggage. Passengers should ensure that these items are properly packaged to prevent damage to other luggage or the aircraft. Number 15. Saws and drill bits. Saws and drill bits are not allowed in carry-on luggage, but are allowed in checked luggage. Passengers should ensure that these items are properly packaged and do not exceed the size and weight restrictions set by the airline. Number 16. Spear guns. Spear guns are not allowed in carry-on luggage, but are allowed in checked luggage. Passengers should ensure that these items are properly packaged and unloaded. Number 17. Ice axes and ice picks. Ice axes and ice picks are not allowed in carry-on luggage, but are allowed in checked luggage. Passengers should ensure that these items are properly packaged and do not exceed the size and weight restrictions set by the airline. Number 18. Hockey sticks and lacrosse sticks. Hockey sticks and lacrosse sticks are allowed in both carry-on and checked luggage, but passengers should ensure that these items are properly secured and packaged to prevent damage to other luggage or the aircraft. Number 19. Brass knuckles. Brass knuckles are not allowed in carry-on luggage, but are allowed in checked luggage. Passengers should ensure that these items are properly packaged and do not exceed the size and weight restrictions set by the airline. Number 20. Bleach and other common household chemicals in large quantities. Bleach and other common household chemicals in large quantities are not allowed in carry-on or checked luggage. These items may be flammable or corrosive and can pose a risk to the aircraft and its occupants. Passengers should ensure that they follow the TSA's guidelines for packing these items and declare them at the check-in counter. Number 21. Bug spray in a can. 
Even though you can find them in less than 34 ounces at grocery stores, they are not allowed in your carry-on bag. However, you can put them in your checked suitcase. If you need bug repellent, I recommend Sunset, which is a liquid lotion that also has sunscreen and is available in trial sizes. Number 22. Compressed Gas Compressed gas canisters such as propane and butane are not allowed in carry-on bags. These items can easily explode under certain conditions. Number 23. Alcoholic beverages over 140 proof. Alcoholic beverages that contain more than 70% alcohol by volume. 140 proof are not allowed in carry-on bags. These items can pose a safety risk if they break or spill. You cannot bring alcohol in your carry-on suitcase or bag, no matter the size. If you have insulin or any other medication, they are allowed through security, but they need to be taken out and clearly marked as medication. Number 24. Hoverboards. Hoverboards, also known as self-balancing scooters, are not allowed in checked or carry-on bags due to their lithium-ion batteries, which have been known to catch fire or explode. If you must travel with a hoverboard, you should contact your airline to see if they have any special instructions or restrictions in place. Number 25. Lithium batteries. Lithium batteries are commonly found in electronic devices such as laptops, cameras, and smartphones, and they are not allowed in checked bags. While you are allowed to bring them in your carry-on, there are specific restrictions in place. You can only bring batteries with a watt-hour rating of 100 watt or less, and you are only allowed to bring two spare batteries with a watt-hour rating of 100 to 160 watt. Number 26. Turpentine and Paint Thinner Turpentine and paint thinner are prohibited in carry-on bags because they are flammable and can be hazardous if they leak or spill. These items can be transported in checked luggage, but it is important to check with the airline to ensure that they are allowed. Number 27. Trail Mix Trail mix that contains nuts is prohibited in carry-on bags. This is because some passengers may have severe nut allergies, and exposure to even trace amounts of nuts can cause a serious reaction. Trail mix without nuts may be allowed in carry-on bags. Number 28. Toy weapons. Toy weapons such as guns, swords, and grenades are prohibited in carry-on bags. These items are considered dangerous because they can be mistaken for real weapons and can cause panic among other passengers. However, some toy weapons that are clearly marked as such and are not realistic may be allowed in carry-on bags. Toy weapons can be transported in checked luggage, but it is important to check with the airline to ensure that they are allowed. Number 29. Sparklers. Sparklers are classified as hazardous materials and thus are strictly prohibited in both checked and carry-on bags. It is crucial to note that sparklers may pose a significant threat if they are mishandled or accidentally ignited. Hence, the TSA has strict regulations in place to ensure that they are not brought aboard a plane. The prohibition of sparklers is enforced to prevent potential hazards that may endanger passengers and the aircraft. The TSA strictly prohibits any form of hazardous materials from being transported via air travel, including sparklers. These items are known to cause fires, which may rapidly spread in the confined space of an aircraft, posing a severe threat to everyone on board. It is important to note that passengers found carrying sparklers in their carry-on or checked bags may face legal consequences. TSA officers are well trained to detect hazardous materials during the screening process, and any prohibited items found in a passenger's luggage will be confiscated immediately. Therefore, passengers are advised to check the TSA's prohibited items list before packing their bags to ensure that they are not carrying any hazardous materials. Number 30. Matches. Matches are not allowed in checked bags, and while you're allowed to bring them in your carry-on, there are restrictions in place. You can only bring one book of safety matches or one small box of strike anywhere matches. Number 31. Paintball guns. Paintball guns are not allowed in checked or carry-on bags due to the compressed gas cartridges they use. If you need to transport a paintball gun, you should contact a licensed hazardous materials shipper. Number 32. Power banks. Power banks are allowed in both checked and carry-on bags, but there are restrictions in place. 
You can only bring power banks with a watt hour rating of 100 watt or less, and you are only allowed to bring two spare power banks with a watt hour rating of 100 to 160 watt. Number 33. E-cigarettes and vaping devices. E-cigarettes and vaping devices are not allowed in carry-on bags due to their lithium-ion batteries that can pose a fire risk. However, these items can be transported in checked bag. Number 34. Medical oxygen. Medical oxygen tanks are not allowed in carry-on bags. However, small personal oxygen concentrators may be allowed with prior approval from the airline. Number 35. Dry ice. Dry ice is not allowed in carry-on bags due to its potential to cause injury if it comes in contact with skin. However, it can be transported in checked bags in limited quantities. It's worth noting that this is not an exhaustive list and that the TSA's list of prohibited items can change over time. If you're unsure whether an item is allowed on a flight, it's always best to check with the TSA directly or consult their website. Remember to always check the TSA's guidelines before packing for your trip and make sure you're not bringing any prohibited items with you. Are you looking for a great deal on your next vacation? Our Flight Finder tool can help you compare prices from different providers to any destination. Plus, if you book online today, you can get an exclusive discount on your next flight. Don't miss this chance to get a great deal on your next flight. Click the link below this video to get an exclusive discount while it lasts.